hello youtube welcome to another video tutorial in this video i'll be teaching how to install deep face live 3.0 on your laptop okay so before i proceed if you are new to the channel kindly hit the subscribe button okay and also for subscribers on the channel i encourage you to join the channel membership as this will give you exclusive access to membership packs and membership videos okay okay let's continue to install deep face live you need to go to the deep face live github repository okay now this version of deep face live you would not need to use the head swap dfm okay all of that will be included in the interface okay now this one is available for windows 10 you can see the release version now let's quickly go to the um, system requirements you can see any direct x compatible graphics card okay so once your system is compatible with direct x your graphics card basically this would work very well on your laptop okay it will not lag so in order for you to check if your graphics card is compatible with direct x open your search bar and type dxdig.exe okay now when you search that you run it as administrator okay now once you do that it's going to open a window okay now this is the direct x diagnostic tool okay now you can see direct x version direct x 12 okay now that is for you to know that this graphics card is compatible with direct x okay just in case you don't have direct x you just follow um what i'm doing on the screen you go to the link above and you need to go to your windows version for windows 10 and you download direct x onto your computer okay so you basically want to go to this above link and have direct x downloaded onto your laptop okay so once you have downloaded it you run the exe file and then you need to check if the direct x is running correctly okay now back to this you need to have um, at least eight gigabyte ram okay on your pc for the for it to run correctly okay now you go back to your direct x diagnostic tool and if it says no problems found then you are good to go that means direct x is compatible with your graphics card and uh, this um big face live version should work effectively on your pc so don't forget the requirements you need to have at least 8 gigabyte ram okay so this would not lag and it will function correctly okay all right next you need to download anaconda so you go to anaconda.com slash download and um you need to download anaconda and you also have to download python 3.9 okay so follow the link at the top of this window okay you have to download python 3.9 okay so once you have downloaded anaconda and python 3.9 so install the anaconda install the python now open your search bar search for anaconda prompt and run it as administrator okay so we'll be launching the deface live from the anaconda prompt okay so you follow the code you see on the screen very carefully okay so i just want to tweak the properties of my anaconda prompt i'm going to increase the font to 36 just so it's bolder now it's much bigger it's very clear okay so let's proceed so follow the code on the screen so we're going to create the deface live environment using conda so the conda creates m deep face live python 3.9 and then click enter so it's gonna load for a few seconds just wait and when it says done you can see all of these packages will be installed so now click y enter y enter it's gonna keep executing the transaction now i think at this point it's complete now you need to activate the deface life using conda activate deface life you can see the code okay so conda activate deep face life please follow all of the codes on the screen carefully okay so conda activate deep face life at this point 
this face live is activated okay so now you go to the github repo for deep face go to the code and download the deep face live zip okay so it will be in your download the zip for the zip file now you need to extract it here okay so make sure you extract it let's just wait for all of the files to be extracted so if you're enjoying this video please hit the like button it's not easy to put together this content okay and also i encourage you to join the channel membership you'll get exclusive access to membership only videos okay membership only videos okay this will be private video tutorials on basically anything you can imagine okay join the channel membership you won't regret it thank you very much all right so once it's done extracting you open the deface life file then you go to the top and just copy the directory path okay so you will need that directory path so you go back into the anaconda environment cd put the directory path basically changing the directory path now you have access to that particular directory okay so now we're in the deface life direct directory or the deface life folder okay so i hope you understood what i did okay so now you want to go to pytorch.org you have to download pytorch okay you will need in pytorch for this deface life to work okay so you need to go to the cpu and then you copy the pytorch installation code and then you go back to the anaconda prompt make sure you copy the correct pytorch installation code then paste the installation code right in that deface life folder now it's going to install pytorch into the deface life folder okay so just wait for the installation of pytorch to complete okay so now i think it's done okay now we need to run deface life using the python main pi code okay so you can see the code python main pi run deface life user data and then you put the deface life directory paths okay you need to use the correct direct directory path because that is where the deface life folder is located in order for the code to run correctly okay so just follow everything i did in the exact steps so you do not come across any mistakes you can see what i've just done here to get the directory paths okay so that's the directory path this will run the face life code okay now it's going to say no module named cv2 okay so we're going to install this module okay so in order to install the module we're going to use pip install and then the module name because no module named cv2 that is the missing module we're going to install the cv2 so pip install open cv that will install pip install open cv python that would install the cv2 module okay so now i'm just going to try to reduce the font okay so i can see it better okay so i think uh we're going to try to run the deface live code again so you can see the code now click enter now it throws another error no module named num xpr okay so in order to install this module we're going to use the pip install num expr okay and this would install that module okay so once again pip install new xpr and then run the python code again i think it's going to throw another error okay so you just install this module using pip install h5py okay and then once you install it you run the python the deface life code again just use your um arrow up button to just open the code and then enter okay 
so let's see it still throws another error so pip install um on x runtime so we'll try to install this module okay and then wait all right so i think we'll run the the face life code no module named on x so i guess we'll use the pip install on x and have this module installed so i think it's installing the packages all right so now we're on the python main pi code for the face life and i think it's running now okay so if you got to this point i congratulate you okay it was not easy okay so yeah so now once the the face life is running you basically want to go to the camera source and choose um your camera source okay so um the resolution set it to the proper resolution and then choose um the source you can use many cam you can use split cam and you can also use um obs okay now you can see in this um version you have the source frame the aligned frame swapped face and merged frame okay now make sure you um change your settings to match the exact settings as i'm doing okay so um make sure you make your settings match my settings exactly okay for instance the, um the face marker you use google face match and then go to the face swap okay and ensure you choose your device as cpu okay so all of these settings are very very important so um you just um tweak around with the settings if you're new with the face life you can always uh, message me for more in-depth information so at this point we're gonna have to resolve some little um errors in the coding okay so just follow what i'm I'm doing you go to your d face life folder go to the x lib folder in the x lib folder you open the mp mp folder and then open the csw folder and then you open the number dot pi tone file with um any coder coding um, um coding notepad you have or any coder or coding reader because you have to basically tweak some codes and i use ctrl f and search for mp and once you locate mp you would need to basically copy out the line of code erase it and then use the line of code in my description okay because if you use this particular code it won't run correctly i have to resolve this particular error so you have to dm me for that particular line of code okay so then after that you go to the apps folder and then open the deface life and then you open the ui folder and then you open the q face detector and um, python file with your um, editor app you can use notepad you can also use idle and then search for um inc and then you have to find this particular line of code and then you have to also copy out that line erase it and replace it with the line of code in my description you also um can dm me for that particular line of code okay because it is very very important so once you have um changed the code you hit ctrl s that is to save the file make sure you save it okay as you have updated the file and then you go to your search bar search for anaconda run it as an administrator you run the anaconda prompt as administrator okay and then um once it's um running you're gonna type in the conda activate d face or whichever name you choose it's gonna activate the d face life and then you enter cd which is change directory copy your deep face life um directory path now paste it there and then it's gonna open that particular folder okay now once you're in the d face life folder you're gonna activate it using the main python code which is python main py 
and then run deep face life okay so right after that user data and then directory and then you paste the directory paths and then click enter okay so it's going to run the face life and this will open the deep face life window and now it's running correctly because i have updated the code okay all right so the deep face life is now running as you can see you can see the source frame the aligned face the swapped face and the matched frame okay so you can tweak the settings to match whatever purpose it is you want to use it for okay so on this one you do not have to worry you have all of the options with the align face the swap face and match frame you can see the match frame looks quite good the swap face looks perfect and you can even see the aligned face so the aligning is right there for you just in case you're moving around you can calibrate it much better in here so you basically just took the settings in here and once you're satisfied with the results okay you you're satisfied with the aligned face the swap face and the merged frame especially as you can see the match frame here is looking good you move a little once you're satisfied with it you go to your um video calling app if it's whatsapp instagram or whichever the case you start a video call and then you choose the camera which you are currently using be it some um, obs split cam or even many cam okay and then you start the video call okay so that basically sums up the deep face live installation tutorial um, however if you're interested in more in-depth information as to how to work the deep face live feel free to send me a dm okay thank you guys for watching this video kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification so you don't miss my next video okay bye